Hi, Susan. This rip walking into the house, um, Pine Ridge. So we're coming in the front. They got new windows, new carpet, front view of the home with the uh, large carport. And there is neighbors are close by, a um, lot closer than the last house we were looking at. We got your wood stove. Uh, it's a new carpet, new paint, which you've seen. Um, the wood uh, tile, which is real nice. Dining room, new slider door. Kitchen, you got the granite counter. New furniture, or new uh, stove, microwave. Refrigerator, backsplash, hardware. This is a view out your kitchen window. So when you're doing dishes or cooking, this is what you get to see. Uh, you have new, new appliances all the way around. You do have a small pantry. Um, not, not a whole lot, but there is at least a small pantry. Okay, so it's a wood pellet stove is what that is. I saw a bag of pellets in there. Beam ceilings. And there's the front door. You have the same wood tile there as you do as the kitchen. Okay, so now we have, we're in the living room, we come in, you have the stairs going up and stairs going down. So we'll go up first, okay? And we'll take a right. And you have two bedrooms to the right. Good sized bedrooms, very good sized bedrooms. So this one has a sitting area, it looks like with a um, windows all around. See you this way, I'll come back up. So large, large room. Great views, again, here's a view out of the window on this one. You see a neighbor across the street. You got a neighbor on the side. You can tell out the window of this one. Okay. Back in, you got a large closet. And new doors, upgraded doors. Another bedroom, just a typical bedroom. Still a good sized bedroom, looks like it's about a 12 by 12. View off the other side, they did put a new fence in, but you do have a neighbor next door, RV. Uh, not too bad, looks like a nice neighbor. And he's, he's right there. Some fencing on the side there. Um, and the perimeter on the back is fenced off for you. Um, and the other one does as well. Okay, so now we'll go down the hallway. And now we're into the bathroom, which has been totally redone. It's a good looking bathroom. He did a good job. You got granite, new sinks, mirror, lighting, uh, new windows again. He redid the bathroom. Looks like um, Brazilian brushed bronze, tile, tub's even new, soap hanger, winterized, okay, toilet, crown molding in the bathroom. Nice looking bathroom. I like the backsplash and also the water faucets are kind of cool. Okay. And another uh, linen closet, book closet, linen closet, books. Another bedroom, large bedroom, decent closet. You walk in right away, closet. He, he put mirror doors on all of the uh, Closets for you. Two tone paint. This room has crown molding as well. Three inch baseboards. Another closet. So this room has two closets. It's a larger uh, walk in closet. So that's a good size walk in closet. And now we'll go into the master bathroom. Okay, and again, he redid this one as well. You got a really nice bathroom. I like the sinks, the faucets. Backsplash again. The wood tile, uh, granite counters. Oh, again, he did the, um, you have a glass shower door. Tile, large shower head, which is nice. So crown molding in the bathroom as well. 
Okay. Um, okay, so that's it for the upstairs. We have three bedrooms and two bathrooms upstairs. So now we're gonna go back down the hallway. And now we will go downstairs. Not too many steps. You have the wood tile again. And this must be what they were referring to as the meeting room. You have your own door. Um, laundry room. So you have water and electric dryer. I don't see anything for propane, propane gas. Um, Wayne's coating all the way around the baseboard. Again, crown molding. Again, new windows. Um, and these are the windows you're worried about flooding and there's, the water doesn't get close to it. Uh, you have a walkway all the way around this one. So I don't see anything to worry about that. Um, let me give you the view from the windows. This is one view of the window. And another view. The backyard. And then the side view of the neighbor, so you can see it. The neighbor next door. That's probably 12, 15 feet away. That's an easy 15 feet. Okay. He has a shed back there and it's fenced all the way back. So that's the downstairs and the garage access. It is a two car garage. Walk down, it is insulated two doors. It's a large, it's a large two car garage. Um, it's been finished. Got water lines, insulated doors, which is nice. Um, does have a water heater back here, double strapped. A, looks like it's a gas water heater, propane. Okay, so here's a typical garage. It's got high ceilings. It probably, to be honest with you, it's probably 15 feet, 12 to 15 feet high ceilings. All right, so now we'll lock this up and I'll take you outside to the back. Uh, Milgard windows. So he just spent some money on the windows and doors. Those are nice. I'll go out this way first for you. Side of the house, here's a fence, neighbor. Fence around the side. Fence goes all the way up. You have a chain link fence on that side. Little gazebo. Okay, so here is the backyard. And that is an adult, uh, 55 and older, um, mobile home park and I would say they'd build on it well I don't know okay so the mobile home park there's a green fence going that way and then there's another mobile home over here with a road so apparently it's, it could be two or three different owners but right down here you see there's a well with some power so I would imagine someday you may see somebody there Hard to say. And then a view of the backyard in the back of the house. Okay, I'm gonna turn this off and go up front and videotape the front a little bit for you.